Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to a most important Spartan football game as they try to stay atop of their division in the Big Ten on their road, hopefully, to the Big Ten championship game. It's homecoming day here at Illinois, the 103rd homecoming celebration. On third and five, steps back to his five. He's going to be sacked. He is wrestled down inside the five, hit down by Denikos Allen at about the four-yard line. Under center now, straight eye behind him, Davis in front of Ferguson. Play fakes to Ferguson, hands off, and now tries a double reverse. That ball is going to be loose. The Spartans are going to recover this baby inside the 25-yard line of Illinois. They bobble the ball on a double reverse. The trick play call by Bill Cubitt comes back to haunt the Illini. Behind Connor Cook, again the handoff to Jeremy, off right guard, into the end zone, standing up. Touchdown, MSU! There they it is. grind it out on the ground. Forcing Shieldhouse to roll to his right out of the pocket, second down seven. He'll stand in the pocket this time, step up, gonna be hit from behind. Did he hang on to it? Yes, he did. Marcus Rush got him from behind. Fourth and goal. Power eye with Shieldhouse. They <laughs> hand off to their tight end, John Davis. No he lost a yard back to the one. So the Spartans with a goal line stand. Three wide outs. The snap, Cook steps up, feels the heat, runs to his right. Steps away from one tackle, guns it down the right sideline. <laughs> it is hit by the Illini, but caught in the end zone by Benny Fowler. Great concentration by Benny Fowler. Touchdown, MSU. Here's the short shotgun snap. Rolls to his right, winds up, wants to throw it down the field, throws it down the sideline. And there is a flag thrown as Isaiah Lewis makes an interception, falling down at the 22-yard line of Michigan State. <laughs> A check off by Cook at the line of scrimmage. Now the snap. Throws it down the left sideline. It's going to be a great over the shoulder catch in Illinois territory and out of bounds at the 42 of Illinois by Keith Mumphrey. Behind Josiah Price, Connor Cook in the shotgun play fakes to Mumphrey, throws inside the five. It's caught by Josiah Price. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, MSU! Shieldhouse again by himself in the short shotgun, takes the snap, runs off left guard, and is hit down by Shalik Calhoun and Marcus Rush. Calhoun got him around the ankles. Price tight right. He's in motion, hand off to Jeremy Langford, off right tackle. Jeremy on his feet inside the five, wow. on his feet to the Look one, to the goal line! He's into the end zone! What a run! Touchdown, MSU! A tough day for the Illini offense. Snap to Shieldhouse, pressure. Coming from Shalik Calhoun, rolls to his right, throws, it's gonna be caught by Harris. Harris shakes out of a tackle, but then dives and gets virtually nowhere. Curtis Drummond on the stop. He lost 10 yards coming back for that ball. At the 47 of Illinois, Connor Cook from the shotgun, rolls to his right, left, okay. winds up, wants to unload deep, does it, caught inside the five, into the end zone for a touchdown, goes Keith Mumphrey, touchdown, MSU, the long bomb, Connor Cook to Keith Mumphrey for a 47-yard score. Williams behind Pendleton in the straight eye. And off to Delton, off right tackle, he's got running room. Delton Williams on his feet, staying on his feet. He's at the 20, he's at the 15, he's at the 10. Angles to the right pylon. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, MSU. Great run to daylight by Delton Williams for a 42-yard score. 42-3, to three, that's the final. The Spartans do pound the Illini here in Champaign. A uh, great team win by our football team. I thought our guys played very effectively. Uh, you know, a lot of wind out there, so it starts with, with how we play defensively and, and we're able to run the football on offense. Uh, Connor Cook did a tremendous job throwing the football, and we've got some big plays, explosive plays, played very well in the red zone as well. And we found a rhythm early, you know, running backs running hard, offensive line was doing an excellent job as usual in, you know, the pass game and in the run game. Um, Coach Warner was, you know, putting us in great situations as, as an offensive coordinator, um, you know, di dialing up plays, you know, when the defense is on our heels, you know, um, and that really helps with the, uh, the running game, when we have a good running game, that opens up the pass game, um, and that's what we did out there.